here we are. Let's start. It's Friday morning. It's bit grey again today, but not to worry. We're going to make it bright and lovely inside. Let's start some music. Start with a little roll of the shoulders. And we've got a little bit of blondie today. So let's roll your shoulders round. We'll loosen up as usual. Get ourselves going. Oh. Try and get as much movement through those shoulders as you can. And then backwards. Always important to do our mobilizing exercises before we start jumping around too much. Lots of these today. Okay, let's loop one arm around in a big circle. Very good. And the other way. And change sides over to the other arm, round in a circle one way. Well, let's do that way. Da, da, da. Fantastic. And the other way. There's Darren. Morning. Morning, morning. Fantastic. Let's do some twizzles. Oh. So we can just relax those shoulders down now. Just let those arms hang loose and just rotate side to side. Get a little bit of movement through your back. Fantastic. Side bend, side to side. Bum, bum, bum. Fantastic. See if you can lean a little bit further. Try not to lean forwards or back. Just go side to side. So we're imagining that we're stuck between two panes of glass. We can only move sideways. We can't move the body forwards or back. Da -da -da -da. Let's do a little stretch over. Side to side, big stretch. Fantastic. Four more. One. Two, three, and four. Hip rotations. Da, da, da. And the other way. Very good. Knee raises. Cracking through these today. Let's go as high as you can with those knees. Keeping your body upright, your back nice and straight. Just bring the knee up as high as you can. Getting a little stretch through those legs. Mobility through your knees and hips. Fantastic. Let's do four more. One, two, three, and four. Nice. Heel lifts. Just lifting the heel up behind. Take the knee back a little bit. So you should feel a little stretch in the front of the leg now as we just go side to side, lifting the heels. Let's do four more. One, two, three, and four. Excellent. Pause it there. Let's take that away. Right, we're going to do another, we're going to do a music sequence. This is a regular occurrence on this uh, Class, what am I talking about? Um, music sequence. We're going to do six exercises. We're going to do side lifts. We're going to do front lifts. It's all stretch. We're going to do bicep curls, tap in the shoulder. We're going to do bicep curls with a knee bend. That's four. We're going to do um, knee bend and arm stretch, that's five. And then we're going to do floor to ceiling. Hands down to the floor, hands up to the ceiling, that's six. We're going to do three rounds. Um, and this piece of music is called Wake Me Up When It's All Over. So, pro oh, let's turn my volume up a little bit. Starting with arm stretches round to the side. Five, six, seven, eight, and up. Feel my way. And down. And up. Two more. One more time. 
Arms to the front, stretch it back. They tell me I'm too young to understand. They say I'm caught up in a dream. Two more. Oh, I like this song. <laughs> One more time. Bicep curls, sort of bicep curls. We're going to tap the shoulder and stretch back. Tap and stretch. Four to go. Then we'll add in the knee bends. Knee bends. So wake me up. And four more. Okay, knee, bend the knees, stretch the arms up. Four more. Floor to ceiling next. Floor down towards the floor, up towards the ceiling. Four to go, then we start again into round two. Two more. Okay, big stretch. Again, up, let me press this button. Oh. Up again, you keep going. Ignore the man behind the curtain. There. To the front. Wish that I could stay forever this young. Not afraid to close my eyes. One more time, bicep curls and hacks. Here we go. So wake me up when it's over. And four more. Okay, add that knee bend, knee bend. Four to go. Okay, bend the knees, push the arms up. Keep going, four more. Okay, arms down and up. And four more, then we're into round three, last round. Arm oh, stretch, big stretch. Oh. Stretch to the front and stretch it back. Oh. One more time. Bicep curls, so tap the shoulder and stretch it back. Take those arms back behind. So we have a little stretch across the arms and shoulders. Knee bends. We can go a little bit lower now, if you want to. Okay, knee bend, arm stretch. Four to go. Floor to ceiling. Very good, last four. And we're done. Arms down, relax, have a little shake out. Very good. Moving straight onto the aerobics because I need to finish on time today. I can't say that often enough. I chose the longest warm up track that I ever use on the day that I need to finish on time. How silly. How silly. Should have planned it better than that. Got a little bit of that will do. So, aerobics. We'll start with a march on the spot. Same routine we did last week. Don't forget the mashup speeds up at the end. So, Yep, just checking my battery. 
I'm waiting for something to go wrong. I have that feeling that something's going to go wrong today because I'm hurrying. Right, so we'll start with a march on the spot. Are we ready? Oh, Barbara's there. Morning. Nine, eight, <sighs> Take a deep breath. Hold on to your hats. We're going to get started. Four, three, two, one. Excellent. First thing we're going to do, or the next thing we're going to do, is heel digs. Five, six, seven, eight. Just digging the heel in in front, a little twist to the side. We're going to do eight more, then we're going to do eight side taps. Five, six, seven, eight side taps. Coming into two V steps and four side taps. Six, seven, eight V step. And another one. Four side taps. Two V steps. Four side taps. Let's cut that down. One V step and two side taps. And again. Twice more. One more time. Back into heel digs, heel digs. Let's do all that again. <laughs> Round two, eight more. Then eight side taps. Five, six, seven, eight. So coming into two V steps and four side taps. Six, seven, eight. Side tap. Again, two V steps. Side taps. Let's cut that down next. One V step. Two side taps. Again. Keep going. One more time. Into heel digs, heel digs. One more round. This time we bring in the John Travolta's. So get ready for John. Eight more. Side taps next. Five, six, seven. Eight side taps. Coming into two V steps and four John Travolta's. Five, six, seven, eight. Go, John. <laughs> Let's go again. John Travolta. Let's do one V step and two John Travolta's. And again. Twice more. One more time. And march it out. Finally. First sequence finished. Marching out. We'll carry forward with the two V steps and the four John Travolta's, but we're going to add in some grapevines. So let's do grapevine first, just across and back again a few times. Five, six, seven, eight. Da, 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 da. Da. Very good. Da, 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 da. Lady Gaga again. One more time across and back. Step touch next. Step touch. Let's have a little swing of the arms. So we'll do two V steps, four John Travolta's, and then great binds across and back. Are you ready? Here it comes. I'll count you in. Five, six, seven, eight, and four John Travolta's. Great bind. And back. Dance. When you get back, step touch again, step touch. So grapevine this time, adding in a step behind on the end. So single grapevine and step behind. Grapevine back, step behind again. Five, six, seven, eight. 
right behind, step behind. Brilliant. Coming into two B steps. Here we go. Four Travolta's. Great line across. Step behind. Great line. Step behind. Two B steps again. Dance. JT. GV. Behind. Great vibe. Behind. Step touch out. Step touch. So we're going to do the great vine across. We're going to do the step behind. This time we're going to slide back on a side step and add a double tap. Then we'll do it again. Five, six, seven. Great vine. Behind. Slide back. Slide. Slide, step, double tap. Great bind, behind, slide, slide, double tap into V step. John Travolta. Great bind across. You got it. Slide, double tap, V step. John Travolta, nearly there on this one. Great vine. Step behind. Slide, slide. Double tap, march it out. Very good. The great vine bit will carry forwards. We'll add in a little bit extra. So let's go into step touch to start with. Step touch, swing in the arms. Five, six, seven, Eight. So we're going to turn the corner. Yes, we are. It's like a step touch. We're going to add in a 90 degree turn and then retrace your steps back. Five, six, seven, eight. I'm going to add in a little rowing action with your arms while we're turning the corner for today. One more time, back into step touch. Step touch. So let's go back to that grapevine. We'll do the grapevine, the behind bit, the slide and the double tap, and then we'll turn the corner. It will be on the other side. Here we go, grapevine. Five, six, seven, eight. Da -da -da -da. Slide, double tap. Turn the corner. And again, we'll do all that again. Great vine. Behind. Slide. Double tap. Here we go. Turn the corner. Step touch, step touch. We're going to turn the corner again. We're going to add in the double curl on the outside and then come back and add in another double curl on the other leg. Five, six, seven, eight. Turn the corner, double curl. Take it back, double curl again. Oh, we are going to do it two more times, twice, twice more. And one more. Then we'll be into our grapevine. Okay, grapevine across. Behind. Slide it back. Double tap. Turn the corner. Double curl, good. Again, great line across. Step behind. Side it back. Double tap. Turn the corner. Got a bit carried away then. Da -da. Nearly did another great line. Let's step touch, step touch. 
Excellent. The turning the corner, we're carrying on. We're going to forget about the grapevine for now. So four touch, four knee, five, six, seven. So give me four touch. And four knees, two singles, and a double, double. Four touch. Four knees, two singles, and a double. Let's do that again. Four touch. Four knees. Double. One more time. Then we'll turn the corner. Four knees. Okay, turn the corner. Here we go. Double go. Take it back. Four touch. Four knees. Two singles. And a double. Turn the corner and. Four touch. And four knees, two singles, and a double. March it out. Right, let's do the four touch, four knees again, but this time traveling. Forwards on the touch, backwards on the knees. Still two singles and a double. Traveling forwards, five, six, seven, eight. Very nice, take it back, knees. Double. Forwards and knees. Are you ready to turn the corner? Here we go. Turn the corner. Double curl. Travel forwards. Knees on the way back. Double. Turn the corner. Double. Travel forwards. Knees on the way back. Double, march it out. Well, that traveling bit will carry forwards. We'll bring in some side steps next. Then we'll come back to the travel. First of all, it's two steps to the side. Two steps back, side steps. Five, six, seven, eight. So if you've got enough space, make those steps nice and wide. Done. Right, shall we bring in those arms? As you sidestep, push the arms forwards. Forwards from the chest. Very good. Couple more times, then we're going back to the travel. One more time. Travel forwards with a touch. Backwards with those knees. Side step and push. We're going the other way this time. Okay, travel again, travel. Knees. Double, side step. When you get back, march it out. March. Side step across, two step touch on the end, pushing your arms up. Then we come back. Side step with a push. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight. Two touch with the arms up. Side step and push, touch, arms up. Good, again. One more time, coming into our travel, travel, and knees, side step, and side step, travel, you and me, knees, Side step, step touch. 
March it out, March. Let's bring in some grapevines again to finish this off. So we're going to do a grapevine across and two single knees. Grapevine and two single knees. Five, six, seven, eight. What's the sense in sharing this knee morning only and knee. Great. Just another lost and lonely wife. March it out for now, March. So we'll do the two side step with the push, the step touch on the end with the arm raise, and then we'll grapevine, then we'll come back the same, then we'll grapevine across and add the two knees. So side step in six, in seven, in eight. Back again. Grapevine, two single knees this time. Great vine, single knees. Let's go again, side step. And great vine, two knees. And two knees, march it out. All right, we'll be changing that a little bit. We'll be cutting it down and swapping the two single knees for a double knee. But first, a little bit of step touch on the spot. Five, six, seven, eight. So two side steps across, two touch on the end, but then we'll grapevine back and add in a double knee. That'll take us onto the other side. So side step, five, six, seven, Eight. Great bind back. Double knee. Side step. Step touch. Great bind back. Double knee. Let's do all that again. Side step. Double knee. Uh, great. Uh, um, great. Uh, side step. Uh, Great vine and double knee. March it out. Excellent. Let's add a little twiddle, twiddly bit on the end. A step knee, a tap back, a step knee and a curl, and then four touch. If you're not sure, watch me first. Seven, eight, a step knee, a tap back, a knee and a curl, and four touch. Let's do that again. Step knee, a tap back, a knee, and a curl and four touch. Let's do the whole thing. Side step, side step. Step touch. Great line back. Double knee, step knee, tap, knee, curl, four touch. Then we do it again. Side step. Grapevine, double knee, step knee, tap, knee, and a curl for touch. We're doing all that again, both sides. Side step. Grapevine, double knee, step knee, tap, for touch. Last time, side step. Great vine. Double knee. Step knee. Dun, dun, dun. And four touch to finish. We've got all the bits now. March it out. We've got all the bits we need for our mashup. We're going to put everything together. And we're going to do it all faster than we've been doing it so far. So, we'll do the whole, we'll start with heel digs and side taps. Then we'll do the whole thing from the V step onwards, both sides. Then we'll take a break and then we'll do it again even faster. So we start with eight heel digs. Five, six, seven, eight. Excellent. Four more. Side taps next. Side taps. 
coming into those 2v steps from four Travoltas. Five, six, seven, eight. John Travolta. Into that great vine across. Step behind. Slide it back. Double tap. Turn the corner. Come back. Travel forwards. Knees on the way back. At the double. Side step. Push. Great bind back. Double knee. Step knee. Here we go. And four touch. Let's do it all again. Starting with two V steps. Here we go. Four John Travolta's. Great bind. Step behind. Slide it back. Double tap. Turn the corner. Nice. Travel forwards. Oh, nearly tripped up. Knees on the way back. Side step and push. Break vine. Double knee. Step knee. Tap. Four touch to finish. And we march it out. March it out. Now, we are doing it again. A little bit faster. Starting with the eight heel digs and the eight side taps. Everything else follows through twice. Heel digs. Five, six, seven, eight. Oh, noticeably faster. Two more. Side taps next. Side taps. Coming into those two V steps and four Travoltas. Five, six, seven, eight. Four Travoltas. Great bind across. Step behind. Slide it back. Double tap. Turn the corner. Travel forward. Smile as you come towards your camera, please. Knees on the way back. Side step and push. Touch. Great find. Double knee. Step knee. Da, da, da. Four touch. Back to the V steps one more time through V step. John Travolta. Yay. Great vine. Behind. Slide it back. Double tap. Oh, nice. Turn the corner. Take it back. Travel. We know it well by now, don't we? Don't we know it well? You know what's next. Side step. Great bind back. Double knee. Step knee. Tap. For touch. March it out. Stretch the arms up. Big stretch. Twice more. One more time. And stop there. Stop. Very good. We'll, um, we'll move. We'll have a three minute break, maybe a two minute break, and then we'll come back and we will uh, do some weights. Well, you'll need some weights and you'll need a chair for later um, for support. So, uh, but have your weights ready. I'm going to sit down, have a three minute break. Drink some water and don't forget, by the way, next Thursday is your next coffee morning. Next Thursday. So don't, mi don't miss it. It's uh, the usual place in Ealing, Jamaica Blue, the cafe. They do lovely coffee. I've heard, I hate coffee, but they do nice coffee and tea and stuff and snacks. So go along there next uh, Thursday. 
at half past ten onwards. Oh, yeah, I'm off to uh, on my own little trip to London this afternoon, just to going to see my mum for a day tomorrow, back on Sunday. So that'll be nice. A day with uh, day with mum. I might see my sister as well. But it's a quick, very quick trip this time. As soon as I finish this class, I'm going to be rushing off, jumping in the shower, two minutes in the car, down to this Penzance station, and then I'm on a five-hour train journey to Paddington. I've treated myself to first class. It was a, I got a £10 upgrade to first class, so I shall be uh, lording it up in uh, first class on the uh, Penzance to Paddington train. How exciting. Free food. It's worth it just for the free teas and coffees. You spend more than £10 on the teas and coffees, but on first class you get them free, so it's if you get a cheap upgrade, it's really worth it. I pretend that I'm, uh, you know, wealthy. <laughs> uh, right, one minute to go. We're going to move straight on to these um, resistance trains. So make sure you've got your weights at the ready. I've got to get this, uh, got this uh, started really quickly today because we've got 16 different exercises to do. It's crazy, isn't it, that the day I need to finish on time, I put in the longest sequences. 16 exercises, 40 seconds on each with 20 seconds rest, four groups of four, and we'll need your weights to start with. So we'll start off with hand weights, and we'll start off with, I don't know what it is first, I have to wait till the uh, instructions come up on my screen. Uh, I think it's bicep curls, yeah, Dominic, you're right. I'm pretty sure it'll be bicep curls first. <laughs> we'll see, we'll see what comes up. I've got a little, sheet that as the music comes up I've got a little thing that comes up on my screen with a list of exercises otherwise I I sort of forget and then I run out of exercises halfway through so I need to make sure I don't forget anything right I th th three minutes is up let's go let's go let's go grab your weights 40 seconds on each exercise we'll start with Bicep curls, what a surprise. Bicep curls, grab your weights. Da, da, da. 40 seconds, bicep curls. Kylie Minogue all the way today. No one else, just Kylie for, for the next 20 minutes. Three, two, one. Right, so we've got 16 exercises to do. Each exercise we do for 40 seconds with a 20 second rest, so it should take roughly 16 minutes so we should be 10 40 50 oh we should be finished on time perfect nice don't forget slowly does it don't rush these exercises make sure you take a deep breath on every rep so breathing as you go obviously but time your breathing with your reps and breathe deeply deep breath out as you lift Right, so first one done. Second one is going to be upright rope. Of course, the classic four to start with, the classic four. Then we'll do some different ones. Four, three, two, one. So upright row for 40 seconds. Lifting the weights up, don't go too high. Don't bash yourself in the chin. Try and get your elbows up. Very good. Another 10 seconds on the upright row. Very good. Lateral raise next. We're gonna bring those weights up to the side. That's too heavy for a lateral raise. I might have to change these. See how it goes. 10 more seconds and we'll start. Four, three, two, one. Six. 
So lateral raise, nice, slowly does it. Control your weight, especially on the way down. Control those weights down. That'll keep more tension on the muscle for longer and it'll be more effective. Oh, yes. Nearly there, 12 seconds. Three, two, one. Rest up. So we're gonna do curl and press next. So we start by bringing the weights up to the shoulders. We push them up. We bring them down to the shoulders and then down to the sides again. Four part move, 40 seconds. Here we go. Three, two, one. Off we go. Curl and press. Down to the shoulders and then back down to the side. Don't rush it. Work in the arms and the shoulders. So the first four done. We'll then move on to another group of four. I think we might need the chair for the next one. I've got a funny feeling in my bones that we need the chair. So we might even have a little bit longer rest this time to get that chair ready. Yeah, 40 seconds rest. Have your chair ready and one weight only. You'll need the second weight in a minute, but start with one weight. We're gonna be doing the row and the tricep extension like this, four part move. Lean on the chair for support, stick your bum out, concave lower back, chest up, pull the weight up to your armpit and then push back and then back down again. Make sure you make those moves distinct and don't cut the corners. Here we go. Into position, two, one. Lift, push back, in and down. Four part move, make sure those parts are distinct moves and you don't cut the corners. Lift, push back. This is good, it works a little bit into the rear of your shoulder and then into the tricep. Very good. 10 more seconds. Very good, we're gonna change sides now. Change over to the other side. Same exercise on the other arm. So, into position, lift and extend back, and then in and then down. Lift, extend, in and down. Very good, keep going. Ten more seconds. Nearly there, time for one more. Fantastic, next one we're gonna do is holding the weights up like this and bring them in and out like this. This is a tough one. You can stand up for this, you can sit down as well for this one if you want to. Here we go, so elbows stay level with your shoulders the whole time if you can. And we're just gonna do a little chest stretch as well. Ah, stretch it back there. So we get a little chest stretch, tap the weights together and stretch back. Very good. Ten more seconds. Mm. 
And finally in this part, we're going to do an Arnold press. Start with the weights under your chin, palms in. And we're going to push and turn the weights outwards. So at the top, your palms are facing forwards. And we'll aim for 40 seconds. Three, two, one. Tough one, this one. I've gone, the heavy, I've gone for the heavy weights and it's tough. Ugh. Nearly there. 12 more seconds. Three, two, one. Okay, 40 seconds rest. So, put the weights down for the moment. We're going to do sit to stand next. So, just the chair. You don't need the weight. You can hold on to a weight if you want to, but you don't have to. So, we're going to do sit to stand. So, when you're ready, we'll... Uh, Take it down, slowly down, descend slowly until you rest gently on the chair and then stand up slowly. Yeah, so nice and controlled. Three, two, one. Very good. If you want to make it slightly more challenging, squat down. Don't put all your weight on the chair. Feel the chair and then push back up again before your weight goes right down. Very good. Excellent. We're going to do calf raises next. So, again, using the chair for support. Pushing up onto your toes, slowly lower yourself down. And we'll do 40, 40 seconds on calf raises, yes. Here it comes, let's go. Up onto your toes, slowly down. Nice. Remember, nice and slowly, especially on the way down. And don't use your hands to push yourself up. Try and just use your feet. Very good, 10 more seconds. Right, we're gonna do legs. We're gonna do one side at a time now. I want you to take one leg back. Support yourself gently on the chair or let go completely. And we're just going to push up and down on one leg for 40 seconds and then the other leg for 40 seconds. So we're going to try and get a nice lunge into that front leg. So one foot forward, one foot back into a lunge and then push yourself up. Stay on that one side and we'll try and just work one leg for 40 seconds. The back foot, the heel can come off the floor, but we'll try and keep that back leg straight. Chair is there for balance if you need it. This is really going to work intensively into that front leg, into your glutes and your quads, the hamstrings. Very good, nearly there. Very good. Take a rest, we're gonna do the other side now. 40 seconds on the other side. Try and get a big step back so you've got a nice big distance between your feet. And then we're gonna bend that front knee, lower yourself right down nice and low and push yourself back up. 40 seconds, three, two, one. There we go. We're gonna try not to use the chair to push yourself up with your hands. Try and do everything in that front leg. Whatever range you can do, work with your own ability. 
you can't go too low, that doesn't matter. I just want to get some knee bends on that front knee. Pushing yourself back up. Nice. How are we doing on this? I don't think we've done this like this before. Also getting a little stretch in that back leg as we go down. Right, we've got 40 second break. We've got four more exercises. We're gonna be doing a little bit of cardio. So the first one will be a little march on the spot or a jog on the spot, 40 seconds, marching or jogging. So no weights required. We're just gonna get the heart rate up a little bit by doing a few cardiovascular exercises. Starting with a march on the spot or a jog or a power walk. It's up to you. But let's be energetic. Here it comes. So, little jog on the spot or a march or a power walk. Excellent. What time is it? Oh, I'm all right for time. Still all right for time. 10 more seconds. Three, two, one, stop. Jumping jacks next. You've got a choice. You can do half jacks. That's our low impact alternative, or you can do full jumping jacks. That gives you a little bit of a high impact aerobic activity. It's up to you what you do, but please be careful. Choose what's right for you. If you don't want impact through your joints, don't do the full jacks. We can do, here we go. Half jacks, one side and then the other side. Or you could do a few of each. I might just like do 10 seconds of full jacks. See how I feel. Nice. This will get the heart rate up. It's always good to monitor your heart. If you've got one of these watches that tells you what your heart rate is, it's always good to keep a track. See if you can get into that cardiovascular heart rate zone. Four, three, two, one. So we're going to do 160, 117 beats per minute, it's going up. Step backs next. If you want to be energetic, we can do spotty dogs, which is a jump from one side to the other, or you can do step backs. Three, two, one. So step backs, pushing that foot away from you, tapping your toe behind. Anyone fancies doing spotty dogs? We can jump from foot to foot. Get the heart rate up a little bit higher. Oh my word. Ten more seconds. Here we go. Four, three, two, one. Rest those weary legs, we'll finish. Floor to ceiling, feet wide, hands down and hands up. Big stretch for this one, just like we did in our warm up, but for 40 seconds. Oh, my heart rate's gone up to 119. Excellent, that's good. Here we go. Thirty seconds. When we finish this, we're going straight into our stretches. Very nice. Last, last 10 seconds. Last exercise. Three, two, one, and stop. Get rid of that from the screen, straight into our stretches. Sorry to rush, but I've got a train to catch. Roll your shoulders, just like we did at the beginning, and we'll have a little bit of ABBA. (laughs) 
roll your shoulders round. Feel free to sing along. I'm going to. I don't care. Roll your shoulders back. And have a twizzle. I feel like I've really uh, deserved my uh, lunch today. I've already made my sandwiches for the train journey. They're all ready in a little bag. Fantastic. Let's do a calf stretch. Back heel down, front knee forwards. We did this position earlier with those lunges, but we're just going to hold the position. But keep the back heel down this time and push the front knee forwards. Hold it there for a couple of breaths. Make sure you feel the stretch in the back of that back leg. And release, let's do the other side. Should we turn Abba up a little bit louder? Why not? Heel down, front knee forwards, make sure you get that stretch. Couple more breaths, ease it forwards a little bit more. Ooh. And release. Hands uh, in front, stretch your back, stretch out as far forward as you can, rolling your shoulders forwards, stretching those arms out in front, and sing along the chorus. Thank you for the music, I'm singing. Turn your hands, stretch your wrists. Very good. Release, hand behind your back, palms into your lower back, squeeze your elbows towards each other. Open up your chest and shoulders. Thank you for the music, giving it to me. Nice. Squeeze, stretch back, open up the chest. And release, shoulder stretch. And the other side. I'm singing. Thanks for all. And finally, let's have a little sway side to side. Arms in the air. Have a little sway. Thank you for the music. Giving it to me. Marvellous. Have a little wriggle of those fingers. Shake out your hands. Shake out your arms. Give yourselves a nice big round of applause. Very well done. And what time? It, look at that. 11 o'clock and 15 seconds. Didn't I do well? Um, right, I'm going to just have a brief chat with you guys on Zoom. We'll be back next week, Tuesday and Friday. Don't forget, if you're in Ealing, coffee morning next uh, Thursday. Next Thursday is the coffee morning, so don't miss that. Let's have a little quick chat and um, let me know how you got on. And if you're on YouTube, well done. Leave me a comment below, please. Tell me uh, um, how you're getting on. And see you next time. Okay, Deirdre, take care. Bye-bye. Bye, Dominic. Liz, bye. Barbara, take care. Bye. See you. Bye, bye Dominic. And um, Di, Chris, take care. And uh, Teresa, oh, I need a drink. I need a drink.